What's going on, everybody? I'm Roger Koenix here, and we are back with the next episode of Welcome to Terra. Uh, we're going to be building our grinding buggy today. Just wanted to point something out <laughs> real quick. So, while I was uh, trying to do some repairs, and obviously this place has probably got more repairs than worth putting into it, I had noticed that there were four cryopods, and I went running all over this place. I could not find the cryopods until I actually went and looked in the menu so it would highlight it. When you sleep at this place, you sleep like a bat. <laughs> like, literally, it's all upside down. That is so hilarious. Uh, I guess this could be the bat cave. So, if you have watched the most recent time lapse, you would know that I tore the buggy all the way down. <laughs> to which you're probably going why why did you do this and the answer is because i wanted to uh, anyways so first things first we need to uh, get a small grid connector set up uh, on this i'm gonna back up a little bit and let's try to it's okay that that did not land straight hopefully okay <clears throat> Get a little control panel here. Oh, yeah, we've got a Probably not going to work. I just thought about it, but we'll see. Yeah, that's what I was afraid of. Okay. Wow, that might have just worked better than what I anticipated it doing. Any gear? Unlock. Nice. Now, we'll take and grind that off. <clears throat> Let's take and get a... Or do I have a connector? I think I have a connector back here. In which case, just going to have to tell it to unlock anyway. Because we've got to hook it up here. laying down okay now to get two weld pads because well we can try doing the merge blocks but we'll see if we lose parts when we take those apart small merge block Yes. That sucks. Okay. But <clears throat> we shall make it work. I 
means we actually need to stop and look at the cost of a weld pad and a merge block and determine the gains and losses of using each. Oh, we only used the... Well, we were to set up an area that all it did was repair those components, it wouldn't be so bad. What else do we lose? Just iron... Okay. Hmm. Let's go and do the control panel. No, do the production. Let's go to grinder. Let's kill all of this except for the glass because nothing you can do about glass and then go to the assembler <clears throat> this assembler let's rename it to the Parts assembler. Let's go to here. Put those parts away. Now. Put you out a little bit further away. something that I learned watching a video earlier today. Oh, the magnetism's got it. Okay. Let's reverse the hinges. Let's try to get this thing Say that's nope, just a little bit further. That's probably about as close as it's going to get. Let's go to here. Lock. Okay, now we can reverse the hinges, we'll lift that up off the ground. Not con 
concerned for those losses. We'll just get that guy over there in the back. Okay. <clears throat> now, the next thing we want to do, this is going to be our grinding uh I'm guessing it will probably have a crane on it too. So hauling may not be its own vehicle. Well, actually, no. We'll have a hauling cab eventually, but we're going to have a hauling trailer that can go between vehicles. The grinder will have the ability to pull it, and the hauling cab will have the ability to pull it. So if we're going long distance, we'll use the cab, and if we're going short distance, like to clean up a site, we'll use the grinder. So... Uh, what that tells me is that the grinder probably should not be, uh, off the, okay, the, the connector should not be off the back. Um, so let's go to conveyor. We're going to grab this guy down. Oh. Let's go there. Let's try to go three across with him. And put another connector on the other side. horizontal okay sorry symmetry man this guy is freaking hungry today gonna have to build a treadmill soon Just got queasy for two hours because it did not freaking Okay, we're just going to do it this way. We're just going to keep something on our stomach for the moment, and we'll sort the rest out in a bit. Alright, so... The next thing that we're going to want is a large uh, cargo... Uh, large cargo... And we're going to want him like so. Why are we not producing motors? Do we seriously, are we out of nickel? I thought I brought nickel back. There's 122 ingots of nickel just right there.
we have a piping issue inside. <sighs> I need to go find the... Okay. Let's figure out where the other assembler is, because I think that's the grinder. That's the laboratory. I think the assembler is on the other side. We need to figure out why they seem to be arguing with one another. Do 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 do. Basic refinery. That's the assembler I brought over, which apparently is not the one that I renamed. I have this concern that the other assembler is like up top somewhere. There's 25 nickel gear right there. So what I'm going to do is I am going to to do it from inside like I did with the last one. Okay, so let's run inside real quick. Sit down right here. I don't know why that assembler is having issues. Small cargo. Air vents. What am I doing that's getting me tired? Food processor. Is there anything that you can make? cereal bars try to get that nutrition level up a little bit okay let me try again on locating What? 
basic assembler. We just try hanging out right here for a few minutes. Because my queasy just went up to level three. Okay, so we need to look at the laboratory and see if we can come up with something to deal with Queasy. That's the food processor. Laboratory. Uh, medicine. We need to make some uh, let's go to the assembler. Okay, laboratory. is not seen. God, this is getting annoying. want to pull everything out into the open but I'm beginning to feel like we need to and I really don't want to break off from building the grinding thing because we would actually need it to clean this whole mess up so we need to deal okay so I need to go take my drill over here in the grass. Mushrooms. I'm not. Oh.
need to start up farms with all of those. I wish the processing of the soil actually would come up with this instead of just drilling for them. gotten that I've gotten that we need uh, I think it's chamomile Give my stamina a moment to come back. That's going down a lot faster than it should. Oh yeah, by eight. 
Probably from the tired one. Do I have a coffee left? I do. It did not fix the tired one. We're losing time out here. does not seem to be any rhyme or reason to how the blocks spawn either. wonder if I were to take the time to actually walk all the way over to the green that would be okay I'm not gonna make you guys watch that so I'm gonna we're gonna pause here and come back after I've walked all the way over to the green and drilled for uh, chamomile So after a rather redonkulous amount of just walking along with the drill and whatnot, I have finally managed to get a little bit of chamomile and some mint, let's see, and plenty of other vegetables as you can see, but these drop rates, oh my god. Okay, now to begin the long walk back. So... Give you an idea of, of how this has gone. If you watch, it is costing me eight stamina to take a step. So, but at least I am back. I'm going to see if I can make the concoction real quick. I'm going to try to keep one of each of those flowers for. Farming, which I guess I'll make one farm to start with. Let this build all the way back up. Still not entirely sure how I even got queasy to begin with. those in, that in, that, 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 
Okay, now production laboratory. Small flasks are not making it over there. Oh my god. Small flasks. Laboratory. Okay, production. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Since I happen to know in the background that we're working on that too. Hopefully whatever inventory those are going to. So whatever inventory they went to. Control panel. Uh, basic laboratory. Is your... all of our chamomile dag oh no we didn't okay put that right there go to production go to the laboratory cancel those go to my inventory grab that Okay, finally. Okay, so let's go one, two, and one. We've got tired again, so let's go sit down for a little bit. Oi. So this is the thing with extended survival. Like, this is... I'm actually enjoying it for as annoyed as I sound having to fix it. It's more the fact that I'm having to fix it like when I'm trying to get something else done that you guys are trying to watch. Like if I was just playing this on my own, it'd be fine. I would just work the problem. not gotten rid of tired yet which means I probably need to lay down in a bed to get rid of it is it nighttime yet no probably not we're just gonna sit here and hang out for a moment and see what happens yeah that's not doing what I need to so let's go to one of the beds I mean, they all have power. Okay, stamina's coming back. Energy is not. We need to get our body tracker turned up a couple notches that's going to have to become a 
higher priority, I think. Okay. Okay, tired just went away. So whatever it is that's causing tired, which we can't see at the moment, I'm just going to sit here for a few minutes and kind of see... I'm just, I'm just going to pause this and continue laying here. Uh, yeah. Well, yeah. I'll be right back. All right, so I slept until dawn the next morning, and the tired is gone. Hopefully it will stay gone. We need to get one or more farms up and running. Let's try putting a farm in. See, that's the tree farm, that's the regular farm. That is not how that should have worked. Uh, give me a moment. I will go look into that. And I'm back. That was because I was in admin mode so I could try to get a couple of snapshots. But that all failed. So I have removed the farm. And we're going to try again. To find out if do wait, I guess I was wrong. I guess it wasn't sunrise that I thought flash. I guess that was part of sunset. So here shortly we should be able to sleep. Let's go check out this freaking farm though. <sighs> Inventory to the farm. Control panel. Uh, 
block renaming. Empties are off. The block is on. Okay, so yeah, it was just some flash of the afternoon or early evening. So. Excellent. Now. Control panel. Farm. Okay. G farm. When seeds, ice, and fertilizers are placed in the inventory, resource costs increase by 25% for extra seed type and rotting time increase. Uh, okay. Seeds, ice. Okay, so we need to put ice. Uh, ice. Okay. And. Inventory, control panel, let's go to the laboratory. I think I saw fertilizer in here somewhere. Gunpowder, rubber from latex, rubber powder, solid propellant, latex, sawdust, rubber from cotton, brass powder. Let's go find Okay, still no sign that this thing is actually doing anything. Let me go look it up on the... Oh. No, you actually have to get the seed. 
So how in the world are you supposed to get seeds? Seeds can be found in unknown signals or can be by in stations, can be used to create foods and vegetal ingots in farms. Okay. So we just have to hope we don't get queasy for a bit. I, I don't know what else to do, honestly. Uh, going to go into the food processor and look and see if there's some decent meal. Carrot bowl, raw beetroot bowl. Need bowls probably from the assembler, which means I may need wood. Inventory full. Run over, put these away. Run back and get the rest of it. Inventory full. Of course. Okay. see if our food processor has no did our assembler assembler made bowls okay Okay, now, to figure out where that ran off to. You've got to be kidding me. Empty stomach. Holy cow. All of that just for that. 
this is called the learning process because this is the that we're starting to get into the tier of the mod that I don't know yet. But it's like, oh my god, I just want to go build a vehicle. Why can't I just go build a vehicle? <laughs> okay. Is there anything in my build queue? No, there's not. Okay, so let's go see if we can't actually pull these parts. Nice. Okay. We need to change to a very bland because I have not yet. Oh. All right, so need to put a connector in on the other side yet. If I'm going to, I'm going to have to lift it up higher if I'm going to use the framework that I want to use. So, okay. I doubt that I'm so lucky as to have an armored hub. Apparently I grabbed the wrong one. Armored. Or let's try hub. Nope. Okay. Um, conveyor. So we'll just pull this one back down here. Is it what I want to use? No. But for the concept of what we're doing, it works. Just one second. I need to take some meds because I am actually in a fair amount of pain at the moment. That is the problem of dealing with lifelong injuries. Some days are just hard to deal with. So let's go to our five by five. We got our right side, we got our left side. Now I want this side of it to be the right side, so I'm just gonna currently kind of flip this over. I just want to see kind of what we're dealing with. thinking I'm going to raise that up a little bit higher and put the wheels under it. I think I would rather it be a little bit bigger vehicle, but everything makes sense. Once we have the wheels on it, 
and filled in and we can lower it back down if we need to or build some scaffolding around it to gain access to everything that we need. So we need, I think I remember there being something about these having a weird requirement. They use steel plates, which I need for the, <laughs> oh. Okay, so we're not going to be able to do that the way that I wanted to. These are three wide. So I think what I'm going to do, let's uh, get a bunch of iron plates. All right, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So this makes the middle. So let's build off of here. It takes a two by two. I would rather the wheels lean to the back. So okay. And then one, two, three, four, five means that this one sits over the gap, which I think I'm kind of okay with. One, two, three, four, five. I'm thinking that I need to get uh, should I go for yeah let's go ahead and get one more of the conveyor Conveyor junction, and I have no idea which way I laid those out. Two, three, four. This is about to turn into a problem because apparently we're running low on nickel. Oh my god. How much gravel are we setting on? Ugh. That's not much gravel. <laughs> We've used up the rest of it. Uh, oh, goodness. Okay. I may actually have to walk to the closest nickel, which would, I think, be the rock at those three veins or at those three veins. 
Where is the nickel and cobalt vein? Six clicks away. Five clicks to go to the rock. Six clicks to go to the nickel vein. Stop and consider our options here for a moment. Let's go in here. There's nothing nickel in that or in that. I've got 107 ingots. So again, why are we... Production. Copper wire. There is some major disconnect. So let's go into the parts assembler. I think I'm going to end up doing this between. Can I just make a thousand of them? <laughs> Maybe you'll actually finish up some of these motors in between. Okay, so we're at the one hour and ten minute point. Going to go ahead and call this episode. I'm not going to do any building between this one and the next one so you guys can see what I build. Just going to spend some time taking apart some parts, putting together some parts, and trying to kind of get a little bit of everything on standby so that I have what I need to build. We'll see how this goes. I may also very well get frustrated and pull the station apart and reassemble it better and if i do that i will do it as a time lapse because yeah that's going to be a frustrating time so in the meantime i'm umbral draconics thank you for hanging out for the episode be safe out there rest well when you do and i'll see you soon take it easy folks bye